Taylor and VG both in the prime. Who wins? Uh, Joe, you ain't spoke for a bit. You can start slagging people Chris. off again. MVG. Chris? Uh, I think he's took it to the next level, so I would have to see MVG as well. Then. Nath? Mate, definitely. I think you're all wrong. Um, you're wrong. Uh, well, the thing is, I think you, when you're living different you eras... You there, Matthew. No, there's no, but you're living different eras, so you, you only remember the, the one that's... Most recent, so like if Webby will tell you, but Webby, who's best, I, I, Phil, I, I, Phil, Phil, or Van Gerwen? I agree, Mark. Yeah, <laughs> 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 Mark, can you hear me? Can you hear me? You don't Mark, get to be moldy, do you? MVG, the average is standard, says it. Well, Taylor averaged 111 for one tournament from start to finish. People forget about that. I, I just think Van Gogh is better in his prime because Taylor wasn't getting like silly averages, like throwing it in like they are now. Yeah. It was only occasionally. Yeah, I think, yeah. I think as well, obviously, Mike's doing it against lads that are throwing like 105, 110 at him as well. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Whereas, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. 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 No, he said. I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can you hear me? On the same wavelength, then, Joe. 